morning. My name is Todd Zastro. I serve as an elder, and I'm here to give you a final update on our senior pastor search. We've been blessed to have only two senior pastors over the last 40 years, so this transition is unfamiliar. We've been asking God for wisdom to show us the person that he has prepared to step into that role for the next season of our church. Our process was designed to help us find our next leader who can breathe vision into our mission so that together we will help many, many people find new life in Jesus Christ. Based on congregational input and direction from the elders, we were looking for someone with the qualities of leadership, preaching ability, and who has a pastoral heart for people. The position was advertised at various Christian colleges and on the leading web-based church employment search engine. Over 60 applicants responded with their resumes. Our team narrowed that down to eight candidates who we asked to complete a written questionnaire and provide links to sermon videos. Each team member spent time reviewing applications individually and as a group until we landed on three potential candidates to be interviewed. After that first interview, we cut it down to two and held another round of interviews. Both finalists spent most of a Saturday with the team and the elders asking and answering questions. That led to the search team giving a unanimous recommendation of one candidate to the elders. After careful consideration, the elders also agreed unanimously. And so I'm excited to give you a unanimous recommendation from the search team and the elders that our next senior pastor should be our very own Kyle Isabella. You'll be hearing more about this, but on January 5th, Kyle will be in the fellowship hall all morning to meet and talk with you. The search team and the elders will also be available if you have any questions. On January 12th, Kyle will be preaching and there will be a special congregational meeting after each service to affirm Kyle as our next senior pastor. Thank you for your continued faithfulness and patience during this process. We as elders are very excited about the plans that God has for our church and the continued impact that CCCH will have in our community. Please continue to pray with us that God will pour out his spirit on his church here in Clarendon Hills. Oh, and one more thing. Here's wishing you all a very Merry Christmas.